my name is ravindra in this video we will see how to add a link in a sharepoint document library by using a power automate okay so let's jump out, jump out to the power automate so this is our flow before uh, explaining the flow let's i show you the how add this list okay so just go to the new click on the link give here link any link you can be provide first i will give link name here ravindra and for now we just copy the same link go c and control here we have to paste file name eight so our url is created if we click on this we we'll launch to our site okay so how to achieve this by using the power automate let's we see okay first i have taken a manual trigger okay after that for explaining you i have taken this step get file content by using path okay so here i have taking the what content we are basically storing in this file okay youtube dot com url okay so for the checking purpose i have taken this after that we will use output of this file content we decode this decode base 64 okay in the sharepoint we get data in the base 64 format so we decode this and then this data okay if first i will run the flow then you will understand it better okay so just test run a flow done click on done so our flow is run successfully okay if you see we are taking file content here in this format we are get this file content okay so we have to pass this content okay so simply i have decode this content by using the decode base 64 expression and we will get this output here okay so simply uh, in the same format we have type here url okay and this uh, internet shortcut okay same spelling and same thing you have to write okay don't worry i will provide this format you into the comment box okay from there you can be copy and simply in the last step we are creating a file okay so let's i go to the edit in the create file simply then we convert this uh, base 64 decode data format into base 64 and then we are creating a file here okay here you can be see this file we are creating so that's all friends if you have any question or any doubt okay you can be ask me or in the comment box i will try to solve out your question thank you friends have a nice day